The outrageous and terrifying television pranks pulled off on unsuspecting elevator passengers while cameras are rolling. The videos have gone viral around the world and they're raising big questions about whether reality TV has finally gone too far. ABC's Nick Watt has the story. That woman is an innocent bystander. The guys with the coffin, they're actors. The elevator doors close. Watch this. This Brazilian TV show snags victim after victim. The clips have gone global. People love to watch this stuff, but has reality TV just crossed a line? It's gone way, way, way beyond anything that we could have ever imagined in candid camera days. Just last week, renowned American magician Wayne Houchin was badly burnt during a prank gone wrong on Dominican TV. He's doused in flammable cologne, which catches fire. Houchin is still in the hospital with first-degree burns, and now there's even an arrest warrant out for the show's host. More and more producers are playing with fire. There are consequences to really outrageous reality television. We just don't know what all those consequences are because we're in untested waters. This contestant on a German game show nearly killed himself somersaulting over a moving car on live TV with 10 million people watching. If this is where we are today, what would have to happen in the next five years to top it? Okay, one more taste of that Brazilian show. This time, lights out and... I'm laughing, but I'm not so sure I should be. Good morning, America. Nick Watt, ABC News, Los Angeles.